This is my Delta printer. It's based on the Cossel design. It's one meter tall. It has a 330 millimeter diameter bed, of which the printable diameter is 300 millimeters, and the print height is 480 millimeters at the edges. Um, it's uh, got a mains powered heated bed, uh, 350 watt uh, heater under there. Um, it has duet electronics, which are in the white box at the back. And uh, it also has the panel duet LCD control uh, touch panel. And uh, in this video, I'm going to demonstrate my mini IR sensor board, which is this little device here mounted on the hot end. So first of all, I'll turn the machine on. I have the main panel and switch here. We'll turn that on. And in a couple of seconds, the board will initialize and flash four times, indicating it's an analog mode. The board also detects the electronics it's connected to. And because it's running with a duet, it's uh, going to go in analog mode, which um, has some advantages. So the LCD panel is now fired up. And first thing I will do is home the printer like this. So now that it's homed, I can tell it to auto-calibrate. Um, I have two Z-probes on this. I have the Mini IR board there, and I also have the original mechanical Z-probe there. And in fact, at the moment, I can use either of them. But for this demonstration, I'll use the infrared probe. So going back to the control panel, I'll touch the AutoCal IR. So it's homed again. It's now going to go down to the bed, and it's going to probe 13 points. And you can probably see the LED flash red every time it does a probe. The LED indicates it's reached the trigger height. Now the very brief pause that you saw before it started going up again, that's where it did the calculation. During that time it's doing a least squares fit, um, fitting seven parameters to the 13 points that it took. The seven parameters are the three end stop corrections, the three tower positions and the diagonal rod length. Um, and it's done that fitting in that brief pause and now it has calibrated. And if I go to the message log field on the LCD screen, it actually tells me uh, what end stop adjustments it's made and uh, the other things there as well, the height um, and some things are just off the screen at the moment. And that's it.